super windy. I don't know how well these conditions are gonna work out. I feel like I'm definitely chasing the light. Wow, <laughs> this is great. What is up YouTube? I am out here at the Great Crater Lake National Park and uh, it's looking phenomenal as always. I came here with the intent of getting a sunrise photograph so I'm here a little bit before sunset and uh, I'm gonna stake a spot, get some astrophotography in all the way up until 5 a.m. My main objective, something I've never done, is get the sunrise at Crater Lake. And so I've done all my planning because today's video is all about being at the right spot at the right time. It is dark now and I have a spot to do some astrophotography. It's very cold and uh, super windy. I don't know how well these conditions are gonna work out for uh, taking a lot of photos. So I'm gonna try to make at least a couple of shots work. Well, it got a lot darker because the moon finally set. So I can see the Milky Way here with uh, the naked eye and it's coming all the way down to Wizard Island, which is ideal. I'm actually kneeling because I'm, I'm scared. <laughs> but the wind was blowing so much to where I thought it was gonna blow me over the edge and I don't wanna fall into Crater Lake today. <laughs> so uh, I'll just show you the image that I got right now. It turned out phenomenal. I'm gonna call it a night here, close up all my cameras, put them in my car and go uh, sleep for like four hours so that I could hit up sunrise. There's a car behind me, isn't there? I just started the car up because I came down out of Crater Lake off the rim to sleep in my car. Uh, but as you can see behind me, we've got some sun coming up quick. And so I need to go back to my spot that I staked out. So let's go. I feel like I'm definitely chasing the light because it is coming fast. Wow, check this out. This is my first time using an app to uh, help me with where the sun's gonna rise. I use this cool app called Photo Pills, and uh, it's telling me that the sun's gonna rise approximately in that corner of the lake at 5.55 a.m. It's 5.20 right now, so we've got a little bit of a wait, but I thought that's pretty cool. I don't know if you could see that. The sun is right there. It's gonna rise right there. Yo, what up? We out here getting lit, like literally the sun's lighting us up. And uh, all my fellow photographer friends left me. And so I'm actually kind of sad because I'm gonna have to photograph this all by myself, but it's all good. Um, also, I kicked a rock down there by accident. And then I it tumbled like almost all the way down. I visualized it being my body and uh, not good thoughts to think right now, a little scary. Um, mom and dad if you're watching uh none of that happened and i was actually back there behind the ledge totally safe and fine um yeah it's all good we're waiting for the sun to lit <laughs> i sound like an idiot <laughs> and there's photographers behind me they probably think i'm weird but also they're from another country so they might think i'm normal anyways i'm waiting here for the sun to rise uh, super boring stuff. The energy drink that I drank kicked in. Uh, if you can't tell. <laughs> Alright. Just waiting. Okay, it's starting to happen. The sun has crested. Uh, and it's lighting up these rocks right in front of me like perfectly. It's absolutely beautiful. I've got my aperture set at f8 just to be sharp, but not too sharp. I don't want any sort of thing happening in the lens with the uh, diffraction, I think it's called. And so I've got my shutter speed at 1 20th of a second, and I'm shooting at 14 millimeters, super wide. So I want to get this ground in front of me that is really uh, getting lit up, and all these rocks getting accented by the light, and then also this medium graduated filter is uh, helping darken the sunrise so it gets the evenly lit exposure. So let's go ahead and 
take the photo right now. And I'm going to focus stack this. I've focused far out on that uh, peak over there. And then I'm going to scroll down and uh, focus on the rocks in front of me. Take that photo. And then after, when I'm at home, I'm going to blend those two shots so it's crisp throughout. Wow. <laughs> this is great. sun's up finally too high to where uh, I think I'm done taking photos. I've taken several different variations. I came down the hill, took some shots, took a vertical shot. I think I got enough, so I'm going to call it a day. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Hopefully this was entertaining. Maybe you learned something. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. What's up, YouTube? I am out here at the great crater. Can't even say it. Neat. It's a little before sunset, but I am mainly here for a sunrise photography. A sunrise photography, didn't say that right. <laughs> Crater Lake National Park, and it is looking... I'm out here. Oh, there's a car coming. Actually, no, that's just the wind. Ah. <sighs>